All right. Good morning, good afternoon, good evening. It's Tragic Life here with another video for Final Fantasy V. We are at the end game, so this video is going to be fairly short. I'm going to show you some tricks um, to get your job statuses up. So let me show you what I've done. So everything is level three. Everything except for Gladiator and Mime, okay? And I will get those. So there's a trick. You can do this the hard way. You can just keep getting into fights, and eventually you'll get them all leveled up. But there is a quicker way. So let me go ahead and show you my setup real quick. So I'm keeping Angel Rings on each character because that protects us from zombie dust, which turns us into zombies, because there's only one way to get rid of it, and it's Holy Water. So once you run out of Holy Water, you can't cure zombies. Um, it was a problem from the get-go. So now we're going to go look at the abilities. So every character is going to have someone with the exception of one. I've got white magic. Okay. Um, so what you do, this only works on the Game Boy Advance game. Don't ask me why. I don't know why. You're going to want your cottage. So there's two things that we're going to do to prepare. We're going to get all of this up so that we can get enough abilities to beat Omega. That's step one, and that's what this is. So this is the step to kind of get you in preparation for that. So on the Game Boy Advance, if you quick save, okay, it'll bring you out. Um, it's a little bit slow. It, take, it, gets, it takes a second, sorry. Um, apparently this has been fixed on all the other versions of this game because it's too powerful. So what you're going to do... You're just going to go in a circle here. We're going to fight two fights. The second fight's the one that's important. So, all right, here we go. All right. So, your first fight's going to be this one. It seems to always be this one. So, what we do is I... My first attack doesn't matter. What we're going to do is we're going to summon Bahamut. Okay. The second one I haven't done yet, so we're going to have fun with that. But it makes a lot of sense. So you're going to do a second one. Be careful here that the person doing it isn't hit with the mind thing because it'll freeze you. So two Bahamuts will kill these guys. Okay, that's not the trick. Um, th these guys is, I think, like 30 AP, 28, which isn't terrible. So you go around. Your second fight is the one that matters. And you're guaranteed to get this fight every time on the second fight if you do the quick save. You get these little guys. These little guys can be dangerous if you allow them to be. They can actually uh, hit you with a move that puts you uh, turns one of you guys into stone. Okay. Um, however, well, that was nice. If you do the Bahamut trick, hit them with three Bahamuts. They will die, and they give a whopping 199 AP. They also give a lot of money, which is something that's going to be good, because before I fight the last boss, I'm going to go do some buying. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to max out everything and make sure I got all the magic. I want to try to get all the blue magic, because I think we're close. But I want it all. And then maybe I'll show you all the blue magic on a separate video. We'll see how that all works. No promises. So it's, they should both be dead now. So you get 150,000 gil and 190 AP. Which is phenomenal. It just it completely puts you in a really good position. So from there, I just go ahead to the next class, which for this one is the can uh, the gladiator. Hi, Charles. Um, then I, I go ahead and I make sure that summon is hooked in. Um, I'm not gonna do. I'm gonna do that off screen because I'm gonna try to do this next one. So the next one we want somebody with time magic. Uh, so I'm gonna give Lena time magic. Okay. Um, uh, I'll keep protecting on it. All right. Uh, uh, then we're going to go with this gladiator here. And we're going to put mug. That's what we're going to put on. All right. So uh, let me also uh, go into the equipment. And put on. Where is it? 
Oh, you can't do it. Mm. Oh, okay. Let me put Thief on. Once I find him. Okay. So hook up the Thief. And then give him Mug. Um, and then you're going to give him the Thief's Club. Cool. Uh, we're going to go ahead and use a Cottage. So this is a way to farm something. Um, I got to get the right fight, so I'll be right back. Okay, so you want to get into a fight with the Crystal Dragon. They're found on the second and the fourth floors of this dungeon. Um, and they're, they can be dangerous if you allow them to be. So here's how we're going to do this. We're going to use your white mage to heal. Okay. And we're going to mug. Okay. So anytime you get the elixir, your next step is you're going to go to time magic. And you're going to cast return. And start the fight over. And you're going to keep doing this until you steal a dragon lance. This could take a while, but this puts you in a position to ensure that you're not having to continuously find these guys, and instead you can just keep fighting the same one until you get it. Um, you want four to eight of these dragon lances, okay? Um, they, they will really, really help you with sh uh, when you fight Shinro. So, um, that's all we're going to do. I'm going to find eight of these guys, and I'm going to steal from them until I get what I want. It's going to take a while. I'm going to do it one more time, and then I'm going to end the video. I think you guys understand, right? Um, next video, hopefully, I'll be beating Omega. We'll see how that works. Uh, the Omega video is going to be a small one. So is the... Um, so is the Shinru. I'm going to keep those as separate videos because they're going to take a lot of time. So, um, until next time, uh, when I get it, when I show you my next video, before I go after Omega, I'll show you the eight dragon lances. So this is going to be a short video, but, uh, this is all preparation for the end of the game. This will put you in a good position. Um, and then hopefully you guys will get to watch me beat Omega, Shinru, and X-Death. So until next time, adios amigos.